Let's learn English. And in this video, I'm going to tell you about explanation text. So let's move to the explanation text. Okay, I'm going to give you the definition first. An explanation text is a non-fiction text that the purpose to describe how or why a certain phenomenon happens or occurs. It has sequence of events and provides reasons for a process or phenomenon. Jadi non-fiction text ya, explanation text ini tujuannya itu untuk menggambarkan bagaimana atau mengapa uh, fenomena tertentu itu bisa terjadi. Jadi itu contohnya seperti bagaimana proses terjadinya hujan atau bagaimana proses terbentuknya bebatuan jadi itu semua akan dibahas dalam explanation text oke, okay, so let's move to the next slides oke, okay, it's about generic structure what are they? so look at here okay, first, a title and also there will be introduction and then an opening statement or sometimes It is called general statement also, don't forget, keep in your mind, okay? Next, a sequence of explanation and then a conclusion or closing and this one is optional. Jadi boleh ada, boleh tidak ya? Okay, let's move to the example. Okay, so this is an explanation text. How volcanoes are formed? Okay, so let's identify the generic structure. Oh, title, and then introduction, general statement, explanation sequence one. So there will be more. Okay, explanation sequence two, explanation sequence three, and the last closing or conclusion. So there are complete here. They are because ada titlenya, introduction, ada general statement, explanation sequence-nya ada tiga. Jadi di sini um, penjelasan untuk bagaimana terbentuknya volcano itu ada tiga proses ya dijelaskan di sini. Jadi makanya explanation sequence-nya ada tiga dan yang terakhir adalah conclusion. Oke okay, lanjut slide berikutnya. Oke. Okay. This is another example of explanation text and it is global warming. Jadi di sini bisa dilihat jumlah paragrafnya itu less than the the one that has been shown. Oke, okay, let's identify title, general statement, explanation sequence 1 and explanation sequence 2. Oke. Okay. So what are not stated here? You still remember? Yeah, introduction and conclusion. So why introduction is not stated? Ya, yeah, jadi um, introduction itu juga berkaitan sebenarnya dengan title. Oke, okay? jadi itu masih berhubungan dengan uh, topik yang akan didiskus and also optional ya. Yeah. Jadi sebenarnya yang main points dari explanation text itu adalah title, general statement dan explanation sequence. Itu adalah main pointsnya untuk explanation text. Jadi untuk um, introduction and also closing itu boleh ada, boleh tidak. Oke, okay, lanjut yang berikutnya. Wow, quiz time. This quiz time. What are we going to do here? So let's see. Okay, it is about vocabulary quiz. Jadi ini for teachers ya, yeah? or maybe among the students with their friends, they can do this. Jadi yang bagaimana vocabulary quiz kita lihat. Okay. Nah jadi di sini there are 25 words. Oh, so how to do this quiz? Yeah, so you can see the description of the vocabulary quiz. Okay, 
The vocabularies stated are taken from the reading text in the previous slides, global warming and how volcanoes are formed. The teacher will give definition for each word to the students by telling them directly, writing the definition on a piece of paper or making another slide about the definition only. Then the students will guess which word is described. Jadi ini untuk teacher ya di kelas itu bisa digunakan um, quiz. Ini juga bisa seperti guessing game. Jadi um, vocabularynya itu diambil dari bacaan sebelumnya. Jadi tadi di slide kan ada dua bacaan mengenai global warming dan juga volcanoes. Jadi kosakatanya itu yang berhubungan dengan global warming dan volcanoes tadi. Jadi uh, cara guru untuk membuat uh, melaksanakan melaksanakan kuis ini itu um, dengan cara bisa dituliskan di kertas selembar atau gurunya yang langsung ucapkan dan juga um, bisa menayangkan slide. Jadi gurunya nanti itu akan memberi definisi dari masing-masing kata tersebut dan nanti uh, students will guess kira-kira description yang definition yang diberikan guru itu um, kata yang mana dari beberapa kata yang sudah ada di list tadi. So, have fun with your class. Oke, okay, I think that's all for today and hopefully you enjoy my video and see you next time. Bye bye.